Did you know that increasing your human growth hormone will actually reduce the signs of aging? So how do you actually increase growth hormone? Okay, there's numerous ways that you can do this. Okay, so for those of you who don't know me, my name is Belinda, and I'm very passionate about helping people recover from autoimmune problems, thyroid issues, sleeping in issues, and so, so much more. Okay, for an extremely personal reason. And when it comes to increasing growth hormone, this is something that you can utilize to reverse the signs of aging. Okay, so just be careful not to bump the computer here. So my little one's here, she's home from school. She's got a bit of a sniffle and it's just not worth sending her today, right? So she's joining me instead. So what can you actually do to increase the amount of growth hormone that your body produces? Okay, so the first thing that you can do, number one, is uh, reduce insulin resistance. And that means reducing how much insulin your body is exposed to. Okay, that might mean changing the way that we eat. That might mean introducing intermittent fasting. That might mean, uh, you know, just reducing how much sugar that we come into contact with. Okay, now my son is going to do the live as well. Okay, so number two is actually making sure that we are getting enough sleep. I know this is a really hard one because if you are suffering from autoimmune and thyroid issues, you may not be getting enough sleep. Like seriously, four to five hours a night, four to five hours of sleep a night is simply not enough to reduce the cortisol and it's not enough to function on. And you know that if you've been there, I have, you can't function properly when you're not getting enough sleep, right? And that increases your cortisol. It um, actually decreases how much human growth hormone that you actually make as well. Would you be able to go inside and shut that glass door for me? Okay. We've also got um, people here pulling apart our bathroom. So we're mid-renovation and uh, they're a bit noisy. Just this glass door, Phoebe. The sliding door here behind there. Can you shut the glass door? So I do apologize for any of the background noise that we have. Okay, number three is actually doing high intensity short workouts can actually increase how much of this human growth hormone. You might need to go in this door, walk around, shut that glass door and then come back. That one might be locked. Okay. Should have organized this before I hit live, right? <laughs> Okay, and this is probably something that I could work on myself, right? I don't really do enough of the short-term workouts um, and that actually increases your human growth hormone. So, you know, we're all not perfect. Number four is moderating protein, okay? Sometimes when we're taking these high-protein shakes or high-protein diets, this actually increases the signs of aging unfortunately like we might be doing it for weight loss or health or whatever that is but when we take in too much protein this can actually cause wrinkles yeah it's not cool right okay so just moderate protein don't go crazy on the protein it is important but it's not something that we need to be relying 100 percent on like everything we need to do it moderatively okay uh number five is think about introducing intermittent fasting. Now, this is not something that I usually recommend clients do right off the bat because there are some things that we need to work on. Please don't touch the chair because it bumps the computer. Uh, before we start introducing intermittent fasting, we need to make sure that we have got enough electrolytes in our system, make sure we've got enough minerals in our system before we start introducing intermittent fasting. Some people really struggle with it and it can actually cause stress on the body if your body is not ready for it. Okay, so please reach out if you need a hand with that. Um, number six. Can you do six? You do the one. I'll do the six. Put one up. Yeah, number six <laughs> is increasing fat-soluble vitamins. Okay, this is your vitamin A. This is your vitamin D and K and a few others. Okay, so increasing your healthy fats, whether that be from eggs, whether that be from meats, uh, butter, ghee, all of these healthy fats, okay, are going to help support uh, improving how much of this human growth hormone your body actually makes, okay? And not only that, when you have enough of these healthy fats in your body, 
when the sunlight hits your skin, it can turn that cholesterol, this is very basic form, into hormone D, okay, which actually supports your immune system as well. Anyway, Phoebe, if you want to be in the video, you have to be quiet, okay, like Sky does. <laughs> okay, so um, where was I? Now she's completely lost track. Okay, stop being silly, please. Okay, Sky and Courtney are in videos and they're able to sit still. You need a bit more practice. Um, so anyway, we have got a challenge that is starting in about an hour. This is your last call, last call for this challenge. If you want to reach out, flick me a message and join this four day anti-aging challenge. Now it's not being facilitated by me. I am a guest speaker in this challenge. Um, and there are three or four other people uh, speaking in this challenge as well. So all experts in their area. I am doing the one on sleep and there is a lady doing one on skin. Okay, and there's another lady doing exercise and then there's a mindfulness lady as well that I know of. Okay, so if you want to join this challenge, it's still open for the next hour. This is your last chance to join. It's 17 Australian dollars, absolute bargain, going to be huge value and apparently there's going to be giveaways as well. So do you like free stuff, Phoebe? Yeah. Yeah, who doesn't like free stuff? Okay, so come along to that if you see this in the next hour. If not, you might miss out. <laughs> anyway, if you want the link, uh, just reach out and ask for the link because I've noticed that Facebook doesn't always um, share this as far when I've got a link there. Probably because I'm not paying. <laughs> anyway, you have an awesome day. If you're watching live, let us know live. And if you're catching this on the replay, then let us know uh, replay. I think I've got Inika on here now. So... Um, and if you know someone that this video can help, then why not consider sharing this with other people? Please don't touch the chair because it knocks the computer. Thank you. Oh. Home sick. Joys of parenthood, hey? Okay, so you have an awesome day and I will see you very soon. And I'm looking forward to seeing all of you in this challenge if you've joined because I know a number of you have. So very exciting. Yay. See you there.